most multi-hit games in the majors since 2019. You know D.J. LeMahieu is going to be in there. And with his two-for-three performance tonight, he now has 84 such games tied with Whit Merrifield of the Royals. Let's hear from D.J. postgame. DJ, did you feel as though you were you were seeing the ball any better tonight? And it also seemed like at times you were really frustrated with the strike zone. Uh, yeah, I felt better today. Um, you know, it's kind of been for me personally. It's kind of been like that all year. Feel feel good one day and not seeing the ball great the next day. So hopefully, I can just get in that zone and 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 uh, you know hold on to that for a while. Why do you think you've struggled to kind of find that consistency early in the season here? Nothing really in particular, um, you know, maybe just a little jumpy, uh, trying to make things happen rather than just, you know, being my normal, uh, you know, just relax, calm self and, and letting it happen, and trusting myself. Christy Ackert, go ahead. Hey, DJ, you've had some, not you personally, but as a team, some games where Mistakes have cost you kind of dearly, some defensive mistakes, base running. I think you have 14, you know, double grounded into 14 double plays. What what are you seeing with the team right now that it's just not clicking on those things? Um, yeah, no, I mean, nothing in particular. Uh, you know, overall, we, we, you know, we've played, we've had our really good games and then we've had some, some mistakes. I mean, that's how it goes, but I feel like our mistakes right now are, are uh, are pretty glaring um, in some of our losses, but uh, you know that's baseball, and and I know uh, I, I you know just just like me at the plate, I know our team's going to start clicking here uh, real soon, and um, you know hopefully sooner rather than later. I know we're real close.